do the numbers, the math, the arithmetic. We started the night with 51 beautiful contestants. Right. Before our very eyes, there were 15, suddenly 10, and now the field is about to get a wee bit smaller. This means that in a matter of seconds, only five girls will be that much closer to a year full of traveling, mm -hmm. celebrity, and being a spokesperson for teenagers all over the country. The judges have made the final cut and narrowed their choices down to five. Here are the results in random order. First we have Nevada. Now we call Louisiana. Joining us now, Maryland. Two spots left in the top five. One goes to Hawaii. One spot remaining. Rounding out our top five is Tennessee. There they are, the top five, and I say looking pretty good. Looking good, ladies. I know, okay. Even though they're acting pretty cool back here, and I gotta say, you guys look beautiful, and I know you're excited, they're really nervous. Because I've been there myself, and believe me when I say this, this is the point when the pressure heats up the most. Absolutely, let's take a look and a moment to talk with our very worthy finalists and find out what's going on in their head right this very second. All right, let's begin with Nevada. Hello, Hello. Nevada. So now you told us that your brother is one of your heroes. Why is that? Yes, he is. He's in the United States Air Force, and he is putting his line on the line for me and everybody as well. And I think he is such a hero to me, and it's such a personal experience, and it really hits home. So, hi, Brian, at home. I love you. <laughs> what was more difficult for you tonight, evening gowns or swimsuits? You know, I'm going to say swimsuit. <laughs> I'm I've never been on national television in a two-piece bikini, okay? <laughs> it was really crazy. Thank you, Nevada. Thank you. Next up, Louisiana. Hey, Louisiana, we hear you're a pretty big baseball fan. Why is that? Because they're cute in their uniform. <laughs> <laughs> At least you're honest. Yeah. <laughs> All right, now, what was it like the night before you left to come here to Palm Springs? It was pretty crazy. I had a send-off party, and that's where my friends told me that they were actually going to follow me here, all the way from Louisiana, and um, just had a bunch of people at my send-off party hanging out, you know, getting all the nerves out, I guess. So they wanted to throw your party before they came to stalk you here? Exactly. <laughs> all right, well, thank you, Louisiana. Maryland. Hello. Hello. Now, you told us one of your dreams is to be a fashion designer. Who is your personal favorite and why? Definitely Betsy Johnson. I love the feathers and I love all the crazy stuff she does with her clothing. Now, if you win tonight, who is the first person you want to speak to? Hmm, I have to say my mom and my dad. I can't just pick one because they're both my biggest supporters and I love you both. Are they, are they here or do you have to call? Yeah, they're right there. Hi, oh. Mom. Hey, Mom and Dad. All right, thank you, Marilyn. Thank you, Marilyn. Next up. Hawaii. Hello. Hi. One of the craziest things you've ever done was in Tahiti. What was that, Hawaii? I went parasailing with my mom and my stepdad over there. Yeah. And it was amazing because you're up so high you can't even hear the boat. It's like so peaceful and you get to check out the Tahitian mountains. It's really pretty. Wow. All right, so what surprised you the most about the pageant this week here? <laughs> the most, I didn't know that I couldn't have a lot of free time. We have a lot of rehearsals. <laughs> it was good and worth it because I nailed every one of my camera shots. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks right, to thank Scott you, out there, right? <laughs> Next up, Tennessee. Hello. Hello. How are you? I'm good. How are you? All right. Now we hear that you love music. So who is your all-time favorite, and of course why? 
Oh my goodness, I love all sorts of music. I really don't have a special kind. I like, you know, country, rap, hip hop, just, you know, whatever is in the, I'm in the mood for. Just the best beat. If you were to pick a song right now, what would you be in the mood for? You know, I haven't even thought about that. I haven't had any time to listen to music. All I've been doing is rehearsing, but I've been having a wonderful time. Wonderful time. All right, Tennessee, thank you very much. Thank you. Great talking with all of you ladies. Good Definitely. luck to each and every one of you. Good luck. It won't be long before one of these top five will be crowned Miss Teen USA 2004. Stay with us. Watch the final five try and answer the final question when Miss Teen USA 2004 returns live from Palm Springs here on NBC.